Here at Big 12 Media Day in Kansas City, talking Texas Tech basketball with head coach Tubby Smith. And uh, coach, let's first ask you about preseason workouts, and now we are into to practice. What are, what's impressed you most about your team? Well, work ethics. I think you know, we've got a great group of kids that, uh, that want to be coached. They seem to um, be hungry to, uh, to be led. You know, they've gone through a lot. You take a young man like Jay Crockett, I'm his fourth coach in four years. But it's gone well. You know, we've avoided injuries, knock on wood. That's the most important thing this time of the year. And trying to uh, develop a system and, and input a system that will, that will fit with all of our players mm -hmm. is, is, has been a challenge. But I, I think we're going to be okay. You mentioned Jay Crockett, uh, kind of your super sub coming in. He handled a lot of the offense and going to rely on him a lot this year. Who else can help him? And is he up to the, to the task of carrying a lot of the offensive load? Well, he is. Jay has had some, I think he had a hernia surgery, a few years, sports hernia surgery, and that's aggravated him some in his preseason. Mm -hmm. But he's, he's a leader. He's a guy we're counting on. Jordan Talbert, who really is a very talented forward at 6'8", can really go to the glass. So he's going to take a lot of pressure off Jay. And I, we're going to find a way to get Jay in the starting lineup this year because mm -hmm. he deserves that and he's, he's what we need. If, we can, if he can convert to the small forward spot, or the wing position, you know, and before he was playing the four position, the power forward, and he was subbed there. But we have Dayon Kravick, another 6'10", uh, big man. I think our front line is going to be our strength. You know, we've tried to add some depth in the backcourt um, with Dusty Hanna, uh, Jamal Williams, Todrick Gauthier. So we feel like we've got some great kids coming in. We've added some depth in the backcourt again with Rob Turner, Randy almost saw, you know, so we have, uh, I think we have a solid group of guys coming back. We have uh, Luke Adams, who I think can, can tr contribute, and Kadir. So we, again, I like the depth of, of experience mm -hmm. that we have. And so now it's, can we play an up-tempo style? Can we get the outside shooting that we mm -hmm. need? Can we, because I think we have the inside presence. Have you seen progress in your team from the outside, uh, the perimeter, <clears throat> especially the three-point Line. Well, I think we're, you know, we will look to shoot it more, but I, we're going to have to have a guy like Dusty Hanna step up because he's a very talented outside shooter. He hasn't really shot it well in, in, um, in some of the scrimmages, but, but he shoots it well in practice and he's doing some good things. Um, and we've got to get, and Rob Turner, our point guard, who I think can really stroke the ball from the outside. Uh, again, I mentioned Luke Adams, who I think can give us some some outside shooting depth. And those are going to be, those kids and, and Todrick Gosher, those are guys. And then, as I mentioned before, I think Jay Crockett is making that transition from being a super sub, a four man to a three man who can shoot from the outside. You've coached, uh, we don't need to go through your resume here, but you look at Kentucky and Minnesota, and now you're at Texas Tech. Is this kind of going according to the plan uh, for you? Uh, <laughs> In terms of building something at Texas Tech, is this where well, you want it to be at this point? Well, you, you always want to be better. And, and not that Texas Tech, not better in where we are, but be a better person, a better coach. And certainly Texas Tech has offered me this opportunity to lead their program, to rebuild their program. They've struggled over the last few years. So, and bring some stability and some continuity, and that's what they've lacked over the last few years, you know, with four different coaches in four years. That, uh, and right away you have to get the players to, you know, really re-recruit them to say, hey, look, fellas, you guys were close last year. It's a new, uh, we have a new direction, not the direction, but a new leadership. Uh, give us a chance and trust me, we'll, we'll um, if, you, if you want to be coached, and, and they are very coachable kids, mm -hmm. No, I think we're going to be okay. Well, I'm sure with your experience, you have their attention, which is a, a big thing. <laughs> you got the players on your side right away. It helps. Away. Yeah, yeah. Coach, thanks very much, and best of luck this season. Thank you, man. Thanks for watching Big 12 Media Day coverage of Campus Insiders on YouTube.